is much better against criminal, but at least Caprice's help. This hand is bonkers. Keep, keep, keep. Look at that. Whoa! So good! So good! Um, what do I want? I guess I'll put Narakatana on R&D. Hopefully he's not playing Siphons. Turn 1 Siphon would just be so, so bad. <laughs> Draw a card looking for Siphon, or just he's got a bad mall, maybe. I'm going to build like a Grim Baco server and start scoring off of it soon. Probably next turn I'm going like Grim Baco Hedge. Plays a Cyber Feeder. Damn. Playing Parasites? Fine. This card's a maker's eye. Ooh, that's a quandary. That's pretty good. Um, let's do it like this. I don't know. I have two. I have two econ cards in the discard that I can that I can get. Um, he's probably playing data sucker, which is good. I can at least get data sucker. Hopefully. He goes ahead and plays a data sucker before he plays like a mem chip. There's a mimic. How does he install mimic for minus one? Oh yeah, because he's fucking Kate. What am I stupid? Alright. So he's got a mimic, he's got a corroder. Um decides to walk in. Do I want to make him pay? No. Normally I would want to make him pay, but Cyber Feeder, so I won't. <laughs> Alright, so he's got the Anarch Breaker Suite. Almost certainly has Data Sucker if he's playing Mimic, right? Very rare to see one and not the other. Alright, Clone Retirement. Let's nug ya. Sharpshooter, down! Yes! That's what I want to see. It's what I want to see. The cyber feed is going to do a great job of protecting Croder, though. But Mimic is not going to break Data Sucker. So, you know, I think I saw somebody post a deck like this. I don't know if it had Cyber Feeder in it or what. Maybe, maybe this guy's playing Cyber Feeder for Desperado. There's the Dirty Laundry HQ. Okay, you're going to see. Uh, Grim or a quandary, so you're gonna know that Grim isn't isn't around. Okay, good. So quandary's there. You want to take a chance on R and D? Ah, fucking mem chip. All right. So this game is this game is turned off. Let's draw a card to start. Ooh. Okay. Let's draw two more, and uh, let's ice up. Let's ice. Let's just put a swordsman on HQ. I don't expect HQ to be like a very important one, so I'm gonna put swordsman there because <laughs> it's not gonna be very good in this matchup. Maybe he's playing like an at man or two or something, but. It's not the end game. So he draws, draws. I'm gonna like build a quandary grim on my server. Draws, draws, draws. I mean, if I can get two power shut down and he's playing data sucker, that would be great. Looking for clone chips and sharpshooters and shit. This is the sort of thing that's definitely looking to give me trouble. But at least I have one point. Draws four cards and discards what? Plascrete, okay. 
Um, let's just put that there, and we'll draw again. Sure. We'll see if I can score a Nisei in time. There's Grimoire. Plays a Data Sucker. Yep. Okay, so I'm turned off. Gonna need, gonna need two things to blow up. Uh, runs R&D. Do I make him pay one? Yes. Ah, brain trust, really? Discarding Plascrete too? That was that was worst case scenario. Do I want a Jackson at the end of my turn? I think so. So I don't want to draw any more agendas. I'm just install advance advancing this so I can uh So he goes digging. I'm install advance advancing so I can play a card next turn because I don't really know what I want to do right now. Goes and gets another data sucker token. Get a shock. Are you kidding me? This is bullshit. <laughs> two runs, two agendas. Give me a break. Clone ship, that's a good one. And then I'll do this for one. Take out your take out your Akamatsu while it's there to be gotten. Click one's draw. Plays a replicator. Creating a copy of replicator. Oh, he's got mad holes in it. Uh, did he have enough money to do that? Uh, you didn't... Did you have enough money to do that? Really? He had two money. Pays one for Replicator. Oh, bad publicity. Fuck. Ah. Uh. Alright, well, let's score this, because I can. Draws, draws. Takes a credit. Plays prepaid voice pad. Get an SMC. 
All this, all these like shitty little things are preventing my power shutdowns from working. <laughs> He goes card drawing, still looking for something. I mean, I can always just win off Caprice, but my goal now has to be uh, making R&D a little more difficult. I have a bad publicity, too. Like If he just runs R&D every turn, I'm just so fucked. How do, I, how do I stop this? I need power shutdown on one. I need to kill the data sucker. It's the only, it's the only good way. Because he's going to get to... Uh, I mean, I guess Jackson could also draw me out of it. He's looking at this one card. It's probably Jackson Howard, thinking about how he can't trash it. Right? Yep. <laughs> Called it. So, let's use Jackson Howard. Oh, I got that. And... Why don't we hedge funds? So I'm going to be able to lock him out of R&D with Toll Booth a little bit. He has another Akamatsu now, so he's safe. Safe once again. So he has a pretty good shot of winning right here. Does not apparently win, but Trash is a Caprice. Do I want to shuffle with Jackson? Probably not. Caprice plus Nisei is just so is just, is just spelling doom for him. I think it's just going to be so hard to get into the remote. Unfortunately, I really want Jackson to be able to like draw past his R and D lock, which I guess he doesn't really have anymore. All right, so he plays another worthless voice pad. Plenty of recurring credits now. Um, yep, I'll stop ya. So, y'all gonna come down? <laughs> I mean, I showed you my hand, there's nothing in there. You're just poking for data sucker counters. Yeah, shock. Right, let's see if you can get in. Let's just install this token grim. This is this is a test more than anything else. Although I'm pretty sure he can't get in now that I think about it. Maybe I should have just drawn cards instead of running this stupid test. <laughs> or like I could clear. Clear wouldn't be terrible. <laughs> he can just he can just get all the tokens back though. He does have eight. So if I clear and then he just runs archives three times, I don't know. It's better if I have like a shock and arc. It's it's way better if you can. I mean, it doesn't make a lot of sense to clear basically if they can just get back as much data sucker tokens as they feel like. I mean, you get the card from drawing, so I guess it's not totally irrelevant. But I mean, doesn't he need to go get his yag at some point? Assuming it is a yag.
So he can parasite this now. And he does. Um, he has one bad pop. So no reason to res both of these things. There's a shock. You know what it is. It's a shock. So take a damage. You want to trash it? <laughs> Never trash a shock in a remote server, ladies and gentlemen. I guess there's sometimes a reason to. Like if you think they're going to put a sand sand on top of it and you want to go and trash the sand sand before they res it. This card's the same old thing. Okay. You gotta click left. Just take a credit, man. Draw a card, okay. So I'm gonna shuffle in Caprices now. Caprice. Caprice. And the Quandry. Those are all good good hits. Uh, let's draw a card. Let's put this here, since he can't break it. Then next turn I can maybe clear. Clone chip. So he has Parasite available. With the BP and the Cyber Feeder credit, it's now like, and the clone chip now, it's going to be very difficult if he just takes money. I'm going to need to win off a of Caprice. Uh, runs here, no res, um, no res, I guess. I'm going to let him trash Jackson Howard. Because it puts in pretty low on money to do it. This side's against trashing. And draws Caprice. Nope. All right, so let's draw cards. Try and find one. Because that's my game plan. Uh, I don't want this priority requisition, do I? No, I don't think so. Alright, so game on. I have Caprice. He takes a credit. Maybe he wants to install a Yogg here. Ah. All right, trashed.
See if he gets me. Maybe I should have kept my priority rack. Eh. We'll see. Now, do I want to shuffle in cards with Jackson here? Probably not. Eh, maybe I do. I don't know. The priority requisition is bad to draw. Really what I want to draw is a two-pointer, which there are four left. One, two, three, four, and then there's three brain trusts. I don't know. I don't know what's left. Okay, so I think I don't want to shuffle with Jackson. He's probably got some multi-access nonsense. So I don't think I want to shuffle in yet. Let's draw cards. That's not good. Let's just trash this katana. It's not doing anything. Um... Power shut down, not doing anything. Really? Is it? I mean, I guess I can nug a memory off of him. It's not very good. Let's just let's just um, let's just hedge fund. I think and uh, discard this here. Hopefully, he doesn't have a way to break uh, Yagura. If he goes like Maker's Eye, I might have to like, I might have to, uh, I might have to Nisei it. If he can break, uh, your girl. Even if he can't break the Yagura, I might need to stop that. <laughs> he sets up another clone chip. So he's going to be able to break the Yagura. Probably going to Maker's Eye, yep. Yeah. Maker's Eye. Ooh, he clicks for a credit first. Then goes to Maker's Eye. Whew. Yep. Kill it. <laughs> He says, wait. Uh, installs the parasite, of course. And uh, I'll end this run. You got another one? Good chance he's got another one. Thank God indexing doesn't work though. And then he just takes a credit. All right, come on, an agenda. Jesus Christ. Can't catch one. All right, so I can clear. I can actually clear now. I have like a reasonable, 
I have a reasonably good reason to do so. I can even discard the third shock. Okay, so he continues playing these uh, these worthless things. What is this? Strength 6 plus 2 is 8. He goes and test runs up a Yogg. Nope, a Magnum Opus. You're not even playing a Yogg? And just clicks it once. Alright, so my opponent doesn't know what he's doing, I don't think, but... Whatever. Should I draw or should I clear? Let's clear. <clears throat> Plays quality time for a lot of free cards. Hmm. Now it's getting thinky. So what do I... I still have, what? I have one clone retirement. That doesn't win anybody the game. doesn't do a single thing, really. Um, so that's, like, an ignorable, an, an ignorable agenda. i got one clone retirement. I've got one Nisei and two Brain Trusts. And then the priority requisition in, in the discard. And that's it. So I've got three real agendas in my deck and then one in the discard. He goes and installs his Magnum Opus for real this time. Really uh, dirtling around the subject now. I could just... Can I just grim my discard? Alright, well... Let's shuffle in that... Uh, what is it? Priority requisition. Are there any... Is there anything else I even want? Uh, the toll booth and... Is Quandry still in there? No. So... I guess I'll get your Gura. Hit you with three shocks. <laughs> oh, there is a Yogg. I killed it. <laughs> All right. So you're out of clone chips. You're out of Yoggs. You've got one card in your hand. And only one data sucker token? Ooh, this is awesome. Um, why don't I just do this? Should I advance it this turn? I think so. He plays Levy AR Lab Access. Get some data sucker tokens back, I suppose. If he runs HQ, then I can... Well, I don't know. It doesn't really matter, does it? He's probably afraid of HQ, so I think the wise play here is Archives. Then uh, he gets one shot, a one in three. He can't run it a second time because after he'll spend data sucker tokens and he won't be able to beat Grimm on his Corroder. Aha! So, that's pretty good. So, 
Sweet. <laughs> I scared him off of data sucker tokens. A good, a nice timely clear. Help me out there. <coughs> Even if I couldn't get all the data suckers with my power shut down, I still have this uh, big old ice. Plays a clone chip. Oh, so he does have a chance to get in here. Uh, what do I want to destroy? I guess Mimic. Alright, let's roll the dice. I'm going to quite literally roll a dice here. I think. Well, I have a coin. I have a coin, but I can't pick. All right. So, it comes down to the caprice. Let's see how we do. What do you want to what do you want to pick? Hmm. Uh, I don't know what to do. Let's pick one. Yay! <laughs> 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 Finally, Caprice works. Oh boy, that felt great. Always pick one. 